nito ay rated SPG. Striktong patnubay at gabay ng magulang ang kailangan. Maaaring may masiselang tema, lengguahe, karahasan, sexual, horror o droga na hindi angkop sa mga bata. Hello everyone, thank you for tuning into my show. Thank, salama po for all that subscribed. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Walang hanggan palam. Today we find out, you know, Maris, or Celine goes over to Anton's mom's house because she wants to, you know, she wants to go see Lester, you know, and so she goes over there and it's like, when can I see Lester, you know, and where is he? And they're giving him, you know, excuses why, you know, she can't see him yet, and they're talking, and she's like, well, you know, you got to accept that you, you're probably never going to see Robbie again, and you, you know that he's dead, and she's like, what do you mean he's dead? So they have a little conflict, like, why would you say that? She's like, oh, oh I didn't mean that, you know, yeah, hopefully he's still alive. Um... Then she asked Celine's like, you know, she's thinking in her mind, you know, I think, you know, I hope to God that you're not the ones that killed my son or did anything to my son because I might be nice and I hope I'm right that, or I hope that I'm wrong that you guys don't have anything to involved in it because if you do, you're going to see another side of me. And then she stands up and she starts walking to get Celine water and she noticed the blood spot right on the back of it, you know, where where she got shot from Eamon. So she gives her a hug and she's like, what's that? What, what's that blood on your back here? She's like, oh, I just cut myself, you know, I bumped into something and scraped it. So, you know, she's really, she's really figuring this one out. Um, then we have Sam and Eamon. They're at that doctor Sanchez's house. They're looking through everything, or Gonzalez's, and they find a, an MSD card that they try to burn in a phone, so Sam takes that. Uh, they find other things linking Mrs. Gonzalez working for Anton's family's uh, hospital. So he's thinking, you know, Anton and them have something to do with their kid being, uh, you know, kidnapped. Sam goes back to work. She gets hurt. So her boss calls her in. And fires her and the guy that's helping her with all the information but before they were filed she gave him the, the the card to see who whose phone numbers were calling and texts whatever's in there so we're gonna find out what's on the text is probably tomorrow and we know Celine's gonna be talking to Eamon she sees his paperwork with everything on it you know with uh, you know the hospital of Anton's parent or mom and they're both come on with the same conclusion yeah we think Anton and them have something to do with it so Anton she's talking to uh, Celine tomorrow and she's like well I'm not going anywhere until you know my son's found and you know we're, we're gonna get these people so uh, tomorrow's gonna happen is Anton's gonna have Franco Go get the burned up body of Robbie, since they burned him with thing, and the police are going to find his body tomorrow. So, Eamon's going to be freaking out, you know, he's going to find out that his son was killed, and he was, you know, they tried to burn his body, and we know that Celine knows, you know, they, they, they figured it out, so, let's get some justice, I say, you know, they killed her son, ripped out his heart. Gave it to, I, me personally, I would want them all dead and I would rip the heart out of their child's chest myself. Because uh, an eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth, as the Lord would say, and I would say a heart for a heart. <laughs> Vengeance is mine, says the Lord. So thank you for tuning in. People, please stay safe, wear your masks. <coughs> Coronavirus is starting to go up, so wash your hands, social distancing. Stay at least three meters away from people, you know, you know, know who has it. You get airborne and float around there for, you know, a few hours. So please stay safe. God bless and have a great day and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye.